There are 75 million Americans as of last year in this country that don't have access to technology, most of which look like me. There's a window here so we can, we can take all of the technology that we currently use and we can create a, a closed working system for communities and be an example for everyone to use. Well, my name is William Jefferson II. I am the operations manager for human IT. Everything's done with our mission, right? Like, so as a whole, we're here to close the digital divide. We attack that on two ends, right? We wanna make sure people have access to technology, know how to use it, but then we also wanna keep things out of landfills. So my day-to-day -day operation may change a little bit, but the goal is to do those two things. We get donations through logistics. They are taken over to sorting. We sort through them. And what we're looking for are items that have reached their shelf life, right? So technology is good to recycle, but at a certain point, it's not beneficial. And we do want to help people get access to knowledge, but we don't want to set you back. What does that look like? That looks like us, whether we buy the original tech, get it donated, whatever it is, we identify how much longer it can be used and we get it back into the community. Once they're done with that, they bring us back our donations. If it's no good, we'll recycle it. If it's not, we keep it going. But the ultimate goal is to make a self-sustaining community that has access to technology, that has access to current technology and knows how to use that. No matter what you think you have, we can take it and put it to use to help people in its bare form. So whether you think your tech is too old to be utilized, whether you think it's no good, I would ask that you trust me and trust our company with that final decision because we can save you time, money, and resources and still help people.